Welcome to Java Forum. Now I am going to show you how to install Red Hat Enterprise Linux 9.3 on VirtualBox 7.0. So before proceeding to install, uh, make sure that you updated the VirtualBox. So I am using latest updated version 7.0.12. Of uh, VirtualBox software. Okay, first I am creating new Red Hat Enterprise Linux 9.3 virtual machine. So I am giving some name to the virtual machine. And next I am providing the folder path where virtual virtual machine is getting stored. Okay, next I am browsing the Red Hat Enterprise Linux 9.3 DVD ISO file which I already downloaded from Red Hat website. You need to register with Red Hat website in order to download uh, Red Hat Enterprise Linux uh, DVD file. Okay. Okay, check skip on add and resolution. Now you select the next button. Okay, now uh, I am allocating 8 GB RAM and 4 CPU cores. Click next button. So now I am allocating 40 GB virtual hard disk size, dynamically allocated virtual hard disk size. Okay, click finish button. Okay, on sign I am going to settings. So settings uh, system. Okay, system motherboard and check the floppy. Optical drive will be the first device in boot order, and pointing device will be USB tablet. Then only your your mouse will be working. Next, uh, network. Network, I am going to use host only adapter, so which means I am going to install offline only. I am not going to connect uh, to the internet. Okay, so all installation will be offline. Okay, now uh, let us start the installation of Red Hat Enterprises Linux 9.3 by starting the virtual machine. Okay, start a data enterprise in like 9.3. So installation screen has arrived. So English United States will be my uh, default language. Okay, installation destination. Select the installation destination. Next, uh, software selection will be server with guy. Okay, software selection will be server with guy. So many options are there. I am selecting server with guy. Provide the root password. So before that, I have selected, uh, provided my local timings. That is date timing. So provide the root password. Next, uh, provide the login username and provide the password for that login user. Okay, begin the installation. That's it. So installation is completed. Uh, reboot the system. Okay, now let me adjust my screen size. Uh, 
Okay. Uh, now uh, what I am going to do, I am going to uh, insert the Red Hat Enterprise Linux uh, 9.3 DVD file. Okay. So what I am going to do, I am going to install some RPM files from this DVD ISO file uh, which are needed by VirtualBox guest edition software. Okay. So all the RPM files are available in DVD ISO file that is in directories, app stream and base OS directories. Okay. So these are the list of uh, RPM files I am going to install and needed by VirtualBox guest edition software. So login as a root user and terminal. So in single shot, I am going to install all these RPM files. Okay, so installation is completed. Now I am ejecting the Red Hat Enterprise in like 9.3 DVD as well. Now I am going to insert the guest edition CD image, virtual box guest edition CD image. Yes, so I am not going to install the software directly from my ISO file. Instead of that, I am copying the content uh, locally uh, to one directory. I am copying my, I am copying the ISO file content to locally. Okay. So from here only I am going to install the guest edition. Okay, now what I am going to do once again uh, go to terminal, go to the guest edition software directory and give full permission. So I am going to give the full permission to the guest edition software. Then only I can execute the uh, scripts inside the guest edition software. So make sure that you are doing this as a root user, only root user can give full permission. Okay, now let us execute dot slash vbox linux edition dot run. Okay, so guest edition software installed successfully. So we need to reboot the mission in order to enable share clipboard and drag and drop feature. Okay, so now I am going to power off this mission, virtual mission. Okay. Once again, go to settings. General advanced, so I am going to enable share clipboard and drag and drop. So uh, checking the option by direction. Okay. Next go to system motherboard and check. Sorry, uh, system motherboard. Hard disk will be the first device in boot order. Okay. So two settings I have changed. So now once again I am uh, rebooting the machine. So open a terminal and uh, run some commands. So I am going to copy paste this uh, terminal output. Okay. So I am going to copy paste this terminal output uh, to Windows host machine notepad. Copy paste. Yes. So I can able to copy paste. Okay. So shared keyboard feature is working. Now let me try from Windows OS machine to uh, Red Hat Enterprise Linux 9.3 virtual machine.
yes i can able to copy paste so red hat enterprise linux uh, 9.3 installation on virtual box 7.0 with guest edition is successful so you can try uh, drag and drop feature by enabling the shared shared uh, folder feature okay